The promise of big data is to sort and analyze billions of bits of raw information to achieve real understanding of complex systems and relationships. IT-based analytical methods have long been an integral part of life science research and medicine. Thanks to the latest technologies in DNA sequencing, the volume of genomic data is growing at an amazing speed. By 2025, sequencing may add 40 exabytes or 40 billion gigabytes a year of new data. Although this opens up new methods for diagnosing and treating illnesses, it also poses incredible challenges to scientists and doctors. As a field, science has become very good at inventing technologies that allow us to measure and uh, uh, collect data that tells us what is going on in living systems, in the body, in our tissues, in our cells. What we have not yet become that good at is making sense of that data, is taking all that data and translating it into an insight as to how to treat a patient differently based on what we've learned about their biology. And many people believe, us included, that bioinformatics is the key linchpin in unblocking this problem. One of the pioneers in the field of genomic medicine is Dr. Maduri Hegde, head of the renowned Emory Genetics Laboratory in Atlanta, Georgia. Along with her team and colleagues, she's working on new findings for better diagnosis and treatment of numerous illnesses based on human genetic information. We were the first lab to bring next-gen sequencing to the clinical genetics. Um, this is in 2009, uh, you know, we started translating next generation sequencing technology to the clinic. So we have been the leaders in, you know, bringing this technology uh, to the clinical setting. Dr. Hegde's team currently uses hundreds of different tests to gain insights that, for example, help customize cancer treatments or diagnose rare illnesses. The focus is not just on a few genes, but on thousands of genes, or even the entire human genome. The genomic data has come a long way. We are not any longer looking at one gene in the lab. We are looking at many, many, many genes in the lab. And this can be very challenging because even today, we don't know what most of these genes do. We don't know what this DNA changes actually mean. So it's like finding a needle in the haystack. Innovative solutions for bioinformatics are a critical tool in this search for understanding. Based on comprehensive databases, they quickly provide an informative interpretation of genetic testing results. If you can bring those two together, the new data that you generate, and put it into the context of what we know about that particular disease, those two together allow you to identify the key insights that lets you translate that data into an action that you're going to take in your research program or your treatment plan for a patient. One example of such an application is Kyogen Clinical Insight, a groundbreaking web-based software solution. The system was specially developed in cooperation with Dr. Hegde and other leading experts to meet existing and future requirements of clinical labs. So the clinical uh, uh, decision support uh, software from Kaijen, this is something what is, I think, which is going to drive the future of how we actually, you know, arrive to the answer and present it to the physician. The idea here is going through a clinical uh, support uh, system, decision system, is that you identify the variants or the changes in the DNA and present that data to the physician in a clean and a clear fashion. You know, the physician has 20 minutes with the patient. They want a clinical report, which is giving them not only the diagnosis, but also guidance. Big data will change our world forever. Each new genomic discovery means more progress in research and medicine. Applying big data to human diseases is transforming how we approach future discoveries for diagnosis and treatment. Along this way, Kyogen Bioinformatics are helping to make improvements in life possible. Kyogen. Sample to Insight.